Hi everybody. In my er in one of my earlier videos, I showed you that you can get new Raven Ridge drivers over the Windows Update catalog. Like here we have what what I always call the April driver, and that's what what you get if you search for Vega 11, the GPU of uh, Ryzen 5 2400G, and uh, that's anyway something I could recommend you that you regularly search here if you think you have a driver problem sometimes you find stuff here and uh, regarding mobile raven rich there are a lot of driver problems especially hp's nv 360 x360 um, there are problems playing youtube videos and so on games that don't run or only run like shit or with corrupted colors so i did just lately by the way, here I'm on my HP NV. What I lately did is I searched for Vega 8. 8 is in the desktop APU, the Ryzen 3 2200G, but also in Ryzen 5 2500U. And let's see what comes up. And first we have, yeah, let's sort it. And we get a pretty new let's call it the end of April driver we get a pretty new driver here and that's for Vega that's for Vega 8 um, mobile so what I just did before is I um, I've installed it on my HP Envy and um, I tested the function buttons if they still work that's something sometimes doesn't work anymore if you choose drivers not coming or not validated by the manufacturer so that works easy and in my maybe half an hour or one hour testing I also had no problems playing YouTube videos and that was really a pain in the ass until now I tried it with several drivers yeah so that would be good news but maybe you test it for yourself if you have the laptop we can also search for Vega 10 and let's see what ha what comes up. Oops. And here we have also 30 of April and also one in s on the 17th of April. And now when, I when we are here already, let's try Vega 3. What the fuck? Oh. What's that? Okay. Sorry, by the way, for the cam, I just do that with my phone. And here also we have... Uh, the end. We have an end of March driver. And um, at least for the HP, dry, uh, HP laptop, I didn't have to force install it. I just up, go went to the device manager, um, clicked on update driver, and said search on my computer, and searched... Uh, extracted cap file I've downloaded here yeah so I will probably just make a test of maybe of potential performance improvements but I would at least for now I would recommend you if you are a owner of an HP NVX 360 or another rain rich laptop and you have problems try this driver and yeah maybe let me know in the comment section I'm always curious about these things yeah so new drivers cool thing and uh, yeah see you